trying to regain control after Haiti's largest and deadliest prison break in a decade. Haitian authorities are scouring the country for remaining escapees. Officials said on Thursday that more than 400 inmates had managed to flee the Croix des Bouquets jail, which had been holding nearly twice its capacity of inmates. Before yesterday's incident, there were 1,542 prisoners in the prison of Croix des Bouquets. After the checks were made today, we see 1,125 prisoners who are in prison. Among those that the police managed to track down, one of Haiti's top gang leaders, Anel Joseph. Once Haiti's most wanted fugitive, Joseph had already tried to escape in July after announcing his intentions online. This time, the convicted murderer was spotted at a checkpoint and killed in a gunfight with police. During the jailbreak, other prisoners were killed, as were bystanders and the penitentiary's director. On Twitter, President Jovenel Moise condemned the breach and instructed the national police to use all measures. This is not the first time inmates have escaped Haiti's jails. In 2014, in the same Canadian-built prison, 300 inmates escaped. And prior to that, in 2010, during Haiti's devastating earthquake, more than 4,000 prisoners fled in the chaos following the quake.